having Hippo as a guest for group eye review today. We're doing it today. Even though it's not a group eye review day, Hippo is tuning in live from... He seems like he fucking lives in like San Francisco or some shit, so I'm gonna go with that. Are you building the height today? You know it, baby. I'm all about the height. Oh shit, your volume a bit quiet? You're a bit quiet. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. Oh, the mic is kind of far away. That, that's probably it. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. I hope that you are all having a very nice start to October. Uh. I know I am. Mm. We gotta, we gotta enable the thok. We gotta enable the thok. Let me do that. Do you literally just like get into the stream and the first thing is type exclamation gamble all? I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of you. All right, so we have Thok and we have, where's Thoky Simon? Wait, it's gone. Oh, it must be disabled. Simon Thok, enable. And we turn on Beppo Van. And we turn on a Simon review. Let's see. Alright, there we go. Hi, Hello, Bucky. Simon. What are Love the best value not. keycaps these days for people that don't want to China? Uh, but it depends where in the world you are and what you consider is not China. Is AliExpress still China? Just get what you would get on Taobao from AliExpress and you don't have to learn anything useful and you can just you know, pay a markup for not knowing how to thock in shop from the thockiest market on the entirety of the planet. Taobao. Oh. What's up, wobbly cobble fox? How y'all doing? Oh. All right. Uh, I have. You, you probably know what this is. Uh. You recognize the box. You know what's in here. But do you know what's in here? Oh. Yay. The sweater is really fading. Well, yeah, this was a uh, this was a test sweater. When I do new merch, the first thing I do is I order samples and then I run them through the dryer like a buttload of times to see like how fucked they'll get. Houses for you and Kate? Yep. I'm too lazy to scratch out my address, so we're just gonna take the box out of the box. There's a box in the box, right? There sure is. Alright. Oh, Ham, you're gonna have a field day with all this foam in boxes. Oh. Alright, there we go. That's the parts for the first keyboard. Let's get out the parts for the second keyboard. So the reason why there are two keyboards is because I asked for a color combo that doesn't really exist. And they're just like, you know what? Make it yourself. Can I open this? Why won't you open? Eh. Eh. Make sure to always just like, like, 
turn the blade towards yourself and then pull really hard with the jerking motion towards your face. You should do Kate's merch idea from last year. Uh, you may not know this, but the October merch is already live. Oh, this one's been opened, apparently. I guess this is, uh, yeah. So this one's not in a bag. Or, oh, customs. Oh, yeah, yeah, it was customs. All right. Oh. So we have some accessories and a keyboard and some accessories and a keyboard. Nice. Oh. All right, for those of you that don't know, if you go to thoctober.blacksimon.tv, let's get rid of uh, the overhead. Are you overhead? Yep, okay. All right, so there is merch. There is Thoctober merch that is exclusive to Thoctober. And this year I wanted to do like very, very high quality merch. So uh, I've ordered samples for all of these. So far, the only thing that's come in is the bottle. Uh, one of these three is currently on the way and the other two are still on the way. Uh, bottle. Very thalky. All right, so uh, there's a embroidered thalk champion windbreaker. How much EU shipping? Uh, most things will ship out of EU, so just put the stuff in the store. So US will ship from US, EU should ship from EU. Uh, there is an Adidas hoodie that is uh, magical. It's classic. God thought. You've got the Hom on one sleeve. You've got the Adidas on the other sleeve. Adidas and Hom. And finally, there is a classic t-shirt. Holy Panda, Thought Kale, Long Pee Pee, Thoughtober, PBT Wildcat Sound Test, Thought. Uh, this one also has a little bit of a bonus that you can't even see in the picture. But there's a Simon Sus. Uh, all merch that is purchased, uh, all the profit goes into the Thoughtober giveaway fund. So, uh, Needs the stripes for the full slob. Are you talking about the hoodie? Or are you talking about the t-shirt? I presume the hoodie, right? I mean, I just looked up like what the best possible like source garments were and did those. I don't like this, therefore I will buy it. Well done. Well done. Yeah, I mean, it's simple enough. Grab the shirt. It's five bucks to uh, the Th October giveaway fund and you also get a shirt. And it's the classic October. You can't go wrong. All right, let's check out some boards. The champion windbreaker is calling my name. I mean, I presume it's going to be bitchin'. I'm still, I'm still waiting for samples. Like I ordered them early, and yeah, here we are. Because unfortunately, they need to be shipped to the U.S. address, and then from there they go to my proxy, which then takes like a week to fucking forward ship to me. Can we get the windbreaker and safety green and pink candy or is it just a details text remnant? Ah, you're you're talking about this. I specifically omitted them because they're see-through. Yeah, I kept everything like singular color. If you want, I can just, I can add colors. It's not an issue. Oh damn, these are clean. What are you, what are you talking about? You talking about, you talking about the Th October merch? Are we talking about the Th October merch? I hope so. Yes? Yeah. 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 yeah I, I wanted like, like super super clean merch. Is it USPS? Uh, it'll depend. Uh, 
to my US address, one ship via USPS, one ship via DHL, and I think one ship via UPS. But anyway, it's good merch, check it out. Support the Thought October giveaway fund. All right, let's check this out. Okay, so this says prototype for review only, not the final, in quotes. Cool. I fucking date love stuff. knobs. It's kind of hot. All right, let's uh, let's open this safely. I don't fucking know. Hello, Simon. New to October. How is the recipients of the giveaways decided? That is a very good question. So the the whole premise of October is, you know, those of us that have the means and the luxury to just have like keyboard stuff that we don't really need. Uh, the goal is to give it to people that need it. People that don't have the means. People that might be younger, people that might be newer in the hobby, people that are in a tough financial situation. So there is a secret panel that basically does background checks on every motherfucking person and figures out who needs what and then delivers it to them. It's our way of, you know, like I don't want to do giveaways where, you know, people just get random shit they don't want. I want people to get the things that they actually want. Generally, though, people are so generous and we have so much leftover stuff that there's a second round of giveaways in which uh, we have people nominate other people. So let's say, you know, I have a coworker or a friend and they're just getting into the hobby. You know, I'll say, hey, I nominate this guy. Here's a picture of him. He's real. And I want to do something nice for him. Does this mean I'm getting a K-pop girlfriend as a giveaway for October? Yes. Yes. Oh, what? Why did I like open it dramatically? I forgot. Of course it's in a fucking hard case. Yeah, let's just get it out of the case. Oh. The boxes are way nicer. Like this is an actual box that can actually be reused for something. Like, you can put your weed in there. This one is way heavier, or I'm uh, way weaker, I don't know. You prefer boxes over carrying cases? No, no, no. Give me a carrying case. I'm just saying it's nice if, like, the box that the carries carrying case comes in is something usable. Like, this is thick. This is really strong. Like, there's no flex to it. All right, let's have ourselves a look. So, one of these was opened by customs. I have no idea which fucking one. We'll probably tell real soon. Okay, this one is purple and gold on the bottom. And this one is red and black on the bottom. Okay, yeah, yeah, I remember. I remember my evil plan. Would this amount of weed be a death sentence in Thailand? You're thinking of Singapore. Amongst other places. Oh. Okay, that's pretty cool. All right, so that's board number one. And this is board number two. All right, both of them appear to have a black plate, so that looks to be something standard between all of them. Let's make sure there's nothing in here. There's nothing in there. All right, not a fan of universal plate. That's a really fucking nice purple, dude. All right, let's get out the detective cam real quick. That's a really nice pur- it's, it's like, uh, fuck, I don't know colors. Kate, you're a woman. What color is this? It's like, it's like purple and like burgundy at the same time, kind of. It's a really rich purple. Hey, dude, can I borrow some money? 
plum. Kind of. Also, way to out yourself as the only female in the chat. It's like, yes, I know colors. Mauve? Whoa, whoa, take it easy, dude. Move just means purple in French, okay? Is this the cycle 7.5? Yes, but it's not called the cycle 7.5. It is the TKD 75. It's called the part one because it signifies a change. And this is the first part of said change. All right, let's have ourselves, to be fair, the colors are fucking super nice. All right. Check that out. Uh, let me... Yeah, it looks better in person. Unfortunately, internet is gonna... Internet. All right, here's a Ron. Just, just for reference. So, this has a red top. This has a purple top. He looks so soft, he is. Are you a reformed 75% hater? No, I still hate 75. Like, Lola was just like, bro, I, I don't want to have to do this to you, but you got to try the 75, and you have to try the hot swap. And I'm just like, cool. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. cool. And me. <sighs> All right, so if I remember correctly, I wanted the red top, but instead of having the ugly black bottom, I wanted uh, the gold bottom with the black weight and the red badge. So basically we're going to move the bottom piece over from here to here and swap the uh, swap the weights. This is black black, this is like silver. You can tell because hello versus hello. You know, honestly, the design is super fucking clean, dude. That is a really nice. That is really clean. I like that. So you've got the the exaggerated gap, but the bottom caves in or comes in a little bit on the sides. You see this? That's so good. You can see with your eyes. That's pretty fucking dope. And, oh, you can see one of them, sure. Yeah. yeah. Take it, that's black, I can't touch it. Please don't break it. What keyword is this? This is the new TKD. This is the part one. 75. So, instead of doing the balls, this is a real keyboard. That is like... Okay, uh... What information is live? Like, is price is 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 pricing public? Like, has the like is is the neighbor page online? Is my question. But Simon, I thought you hated Universal Plate. Yes, I do. I think Universal Plate is fucking terrible. Why is this? Oh, cool. I don't know what you just did, Kate, but we lost a foot. Okay, so the feet, by the way, hides screws. So, they can easily pop out. Oh! Is the only reason you're willing to ignore 75 in your universal plate because it's TKD? Um, I'm not ignoring it. Why would I ignore it? Alright, let's see what's... Let's see if there's another plate in here. So this... Oh, they're both... Both of these have been opened. What the fuck? Alright, what accessories do I get? Oh boy. Alright, let's go. Alright, so this is a solder PCB. This is a hot swap PCB. Unfortunately, we have to use the hot swap PCB. I was specifically told to do so. And it looks like we have every single plate option. Which is perfect. Here's a pack of stabs. We're gonna use them. Beautiful. And... Let's see what we got. Mm. 
Why are you for- Okay, this is FR4. Fuck FR4. Why am I forced to? Uh, because apparently there's- He's doing something new with the hot swap and he needs somebody to actually test it. Some dude from Delta Key said the price will be 250 to 260 for EU folks. That seems higher than the price that I have. Even taking into account EU equals cup. Okay, so Polycarb, what's the last one? So we have Polycarb, FR4, and Carbon Fiber. God damn. All right, so we're going to Polycarb and that's it. 200 US dollars for China. Yeah, that is uh, closer to the number that's in my head. Carbon fiber would be hot. You know? All right. Let, let me check this one, see if there's anything different in here. Uh, ba, 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 ba. There is not. Okay. You... Carbon fiber with MX Browns. I'm not going to use MX Browns. I am going to use probably some sussy switches that came with the QB kit because it's all I fucking have. Do I carbon fiber? No, 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 no. It's it's top mount. I I want the little bit more flexibility I'm going to get with a uh, polycarb. All right. Just such a fucking nice bottom, though. Goddamn. All right, let's do a full-on uh, disassembly. Full-on, baby. You're gonna see my beautiful color combo that I will create in front of your very eyes. Simon, for the class 1800, which plate would you recommend? Get the softest plate you can. Because generally, an 1800, you want to go plateless, and you want it to be nice and flexy, but that's not really an option. You definitely do need a plate on the class. So get whatever the flexi list. Champagne bottom, red top, yes, but with red badge and black weight. It's, it's going to be dope. If we go buy how cycle eight was for the price, China and International, this is going to be two hundred and thirty U.S. dollars. I still don't know what the exact international pricing is, but I know like I know the like target price point for it. Like this is not coming in trying to be the cycle seven. This is TKD coming into a little bit of maturity and being like, okay, listen, we've been running shit at cost, and that led to stupid shit like the titanium incident, like the PCB incident where we realistically ended up losing money in the end. So this time, uh, we're going to be fucking responsible and just make a really good keyboard for the best price we can. And so they did. Simon, why don't you use electric screwdriver? Some, I'm a man. I'm a real man. I use my hands. It's such a nut. It's such a nice fucking bottom. Look at all that brass. Hmm. Hmm. All right, so we're not going to touch this purple top at all. To be fair, the purple top on the black bottom is also going to be bitching. All right, let's get all these parts apart. That uses an incredibly fucking small thingy. Okay, it's bigger than... Wait. Is it the same size? No, it's not. Okay. Thought it was fucking high. Okay, you're too big. All right, so 2.0 is too big. 1.5 is too small. Is there a 1.75? 0.9, 0.7, 0.8, 0.9, 0.7, 0.8, 0.9, 0.7, 0.8, 0.9, 0.7, 0.8, 0.9, 0.8, 0.8, 0.8, 0.8, 0.8, 0.
also a 1.5, and you're too small. Wait, what the fuck? Hello? You small one with a rubber band? These crews are really small. I don't want to fucking risk it. Okay, what size are you? You're too small. All right, I've gone through the entirety of my tools. Check the accessories box. I did. There was no tool in there. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh shit. Oh. Right. Yeah, there's no tool. Unless it's in the daughter board box. It is not. Okay. Uh, I feel like I'm missing a screwdriver? Like, okay, a 2.0 barely... No, no. A 2.0 does not fit in there. There's another bag. Uh, one is tabs and one is uh, daughter board. And then 1.5 just turns. It just turns. How am I supposed to open this? Like, there's nothing between 1.5 and 2. And I'm confused, because they give you another daughter board. Alright, time to go get the fucking you-know-what. Time for the iFixit kit. Surely not Imperial? I think it's just like 1.75 or 1 1.8 or some weird fucking size. I just thought I was going to go get an iFixit kit. Alright. Are you the correct size? No, you're too small. Alright, so one size larger would be this guy? Yep, okay. We got it. So this size apparently is a T8H. Whatever that means. Okay, this is, uh, can we magnet? Really? You're using non-ferrous screws, really? make sure that these are non-ferrous. Yeah, these are absolutely non-ferrous. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just a TA. No, the screws for the weights are different than the screws for the case because it would make no sense to use these kind of screws on something like this. All right, how do I do this without ruining it with my terrible hands? All right, we got it. Dirty, dirty girl, aren't you? Oh my, okay, guys, delete the VOD. <laughs> 
the bottom is so fucking nice. Okay, so it looks like we have one, two, three, four large weights that... Okay, so wait, four large weights, uh, four large screws, four small screws that hold in the large weight. And then looks like two. Oh, so this thing just literally houses your daughter board. All right. That's way too big. That's way too small. All right. Are you a hex two? You are. All right. Let's get this weight out of here. Make me want a 75. I mean, I would wait for a not 75 because generally they do tend to reuse at least a little bit of like their design ideology. And to be fair, like looking at like the internals of this board, this board is like the prettiest internals I've seen. When I say internals, I mean the parts you're not even supposed to see. Though, uh, none of the screws being ferrous fucking sucks donkey balls. Have you seen the cloud lines internals? I have never in my life even sn smelled a cloud line. All right, if I am correct, then the bottom weight, the big weight, should just plop right out when I lift this. It has indeed plopped. That's a good plop right there. Ooh, and there's little alignment ridges, dude. You know? Like, sometimes, like, you take something apart and you're just like, God damn. God damn. Motherfuckers did work. All right, this daughter board screws are a third type of screw, which fair enough, whatever. And it's not that, so it's bigger than a 1.3, so I'm going to presume it's a 1.5. Uh, hello? Oh, this is a 1.5. Okay, I had the right tool all along. Ooh, that is tight. Like a toyger. Okay, and this should get the daughter board out, as well as the cute little badge. All right, and yep, comes right out. Look at that, look at that, and this is like beautifully patina too. Check this out. This feels like it's made out of like cement. Like this feels like a rock, not metal. Or I guess it's just the coating. Like it's heavier than aluminum, so it's either like brass or like, I don't know, could be anything. Let's not worry about it. All right, we have fully taken apart the first board. Now what we need to do is grab the parts out of the second board and shove it into the first board. So this is the shiny weight. We're going to put the shiny weight on the, uh, whatever. We'll, we'll figure it out. Wear balls. No more balls. That is a weird texture. No fucking way. There is a tiny, like fucking microscopic, like thin, like soft touch material. Here, there, I just scoured it with my thumb between the weight and the case to reduce ping. Like, it's so fucking thing. Like, the depth of that scratch is how thick it is. God damn. 
you know? Sometimes keyboard designers design keyboards good. Why though? To reduce pain. Because pain. It allows it to act more as like a like a, a a piece of mass than as a tuning fork. So you get the benefits of adding mass without getting the overly like dead sound you'd get from a 75. Force break basically? Yeah, kind of. All right, let's get the second one apart. And then we do we do the naughty naughty. Okay, am I high or are literally none of this crews? Ferris. I think literally none of this crews are Ferris. Why does it say VTX engine? Uh, because Vertex. It is Vertex. Now the other brands will copy this. The other brands... I fucking doubt it. Like, TKD has always gone, like, above and beyond in terms of, like, the wildness of the shit that they do at their price point. Which is why, you know, I stroke their cock and fondle their balls so hard. Because they actually do a good job. I wish any of the screws were fucking Ferris, that'd be great. It's not a coincidence Neo comes out with the Neo 75 just now. I mean, to be fair, 75 is a really common layout. I wouldn't say that they're doing it as like a, a response or could just be a big fucking coincidence. Did Simon scream when he saw 75? I was unhappy. I was unhappy that like the only reason why I'm taking the time to actually check this out is to give like like behind the scenes like notes to uh to lolo all right goodbye red top and let's do some unscrewing but before that I'm not sure why, but 75% layout is ugly to me. Uh, because your brain works. You know how like uh. people like, can I fill beer in that bottle? You absolutely can, but it uses a straw. So maybe fizzy drinks are probably not the best idea. And you probably have to wash it a lot. Dude, what material are these fucking screws made out of for them to not be ferrous? Like, did they make them all out of fucking, like, Swiss cheese or Gouda? Is that a surprise Pikachu shirt? Yes. It is indeed a surprise Pikachu shirt. It's a custom-made shirt uh, by Laser Ninja. Is this the first 75 you are reviewing? No, it is not. You would know that if you uh, did words. Oh, I mixed up the screws. Uh, let's unmix up the screws real quick. Yeah, these are small and these are slightly fatter. Versions of this with a good layout are gonna go so hard. I hard agree. comes out. Oh, beautiful fucking machining marks. That's so hot. All right, and then finally we pull out, uh, what was it, a hex two? Ah! Yeah, it's a hex two. Okay.
If this was a full TKL. Oh yeah, that'd be hot. I mean, again, I don't know why they decided. I mean, I understand why they went 75 as the first of this line. Because like normies are gonna definitely buy more 75s than TKLs. So let them test out their, you know, new wild ideas on normies before they test it out on enthusiasts. But they made the mistake of just making a really good keyboard. So feels bad. What's the cover weight? So there's a internal brass piece that is under the PCB plate assembly. Under that are two steel weights on the inside, and then on the bottom, there's an additional steel weight, which is what we're unscrewing right here. And then there's also the uh, the little, uh, isn't this targeted to enthusiasts? I, I guess, like the way that it's designed and like the build materials and all of that tells me it's like designed for enthusiasts, but then it's a 75%, like, which is like the least enthusiast fucking thing possible. Isn't it in stock? It is indeed in stock. Thank you for reminding me. Uh, okay, I have daughterboard screws, but I don't know where my other daughterboard screws are. Let's not worry about it. All right, it's time. Boom. We have done the naughty. And now what we do is I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna show you what it looks like. I'm just gonna do it. All right, and then you, uh, if I'm not mistaken, go like this, and then like this. Get in the fucking hole. Wrong way? You're you're the wrong way. Oh, it literally was the wrong way. Wait, is it in the hole? Nope. I'm trying to not spoiler. Alright, we got it. Ah, oh, I'm trying so hard to not spoiler. There is no wrong ways, just not enough lube. True words of wisdom have truer words of wisdom have never been spoken. Uh, what screw size is this? I guess it's that one. Simon, what wiki article should I do next apart from Thoctober? Thoctober has already been done. I just think that it, a link to it is missing from the lore page. I don't know. The badge sliding in made a nice sound. Oh yeah. I'm kind of glad that I got to like fully take it apart and like look way inside because otherwise we wouldn't have normally. All right, let's get this home hair out of there. Oh yeah, that's hot. What's the weight of this thing? It's a hefty boy. We have yet to weigh it. But it is hefty. You've got your internal brass, you've got your internal steel, you've got your external steel, you've got your badge, which I presume is brass, if I had to guess. Well, me, I literally just said the words that you wrote in chat with my mouth. Are you gonna publish a YouTube review for this? I don't know. Because the the reason that I'm testing this is to, is like internal testing. I, I mean, probably. I don't wanna fucking, 
type on a hot swap 75 for a month. All right, where's the top? There's the top. All right. So this is the color combo that I was going for. You guys ready? Iron Man. LZ Iron, let's fucking go. So, red top, champagne bottom, red badge, black weight, like PVD black. I am Iron Man. All right, and now let's put together the other one, which I am sure will also look pretty good. Where's, where's the weight? Hello? Wait, oh, there's. Okay. And then this. All right, and we do the same thing again for this one. I think, yeah, these first. I am more biased to purple black bottom. I mean, there's no wrong answers. Wait. Yeah, no, I didn't want a black bottom because of my fingerprints. Because, like, purple black bottom, like, Conceptually, it's something I really like, but knowing my terrible fingers, as uh, a disaster waiting to happen. The purple is just so unique. Yeah, the purple is super fucking nice. And to be fair, like the, the purple with the uh, uh, with the champagne bottom is fucking sick. But we improve. Where the fuck are my daughter board screws? Yeah, like, I don't see them. And I definitely removed them. They're not there. They're not here. I'm kind of confused. Like, the daughter board screws are unique. Like, they're really long and thin. I don't see them anywhere. Like, what the fuck did I do with them? Did I eat them? Did they fall off? They gotta be like somewhere over here. Right? 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 Right, you can be fucking serious. Did I eat them? These are case screws. So right here are case screws and right here are weight screws. Oh wait, wait, wait. Two of these are different. when it's in the hole. All right. And this one we're gonna close up fully. Because we are not building it today. Oh God. Let's get you in the hole, get in the hole, get in the hole. My stomach is still so sussy. I need something to settle my stomach. Brass in. I fucking love knobs.
Mr. Gator Kiss? I didn't. I will kiss the gator to celebrate us finishing putting this keyboard back together. So we can check out the purple top black bottom, which again is a combo that you cannot buy. Purple with black so much better. Mm, I don't know. Didn't you want the red badge? Yeah, it's over there. This is the keyboard that I want. These are the extra parts. Because black. Yeah, there's a reason why I can't have black keyboards. Like the second I touch it once, it's ruined forever. I have a particular set of skills. Since you won't need the purple one, is it up for the October giveaway? If I can get permission, then it would be, yes. I love the little feats. The feats. The feats. Alright, we got it. There it is. Purple top, black bottom. With a weird colored badge. Do you know if international pricing will be the same as the advertised Chinese pricing? I am not yet sure what is public and what is not. All right, we have put together the purple boy. The purple boy is going into a hard case, and then we kiss the alligator. Why is the badge a trapezoid? It's actually a rhombus. I hate this carpet so much. I hate this carpet so much. I want to light it on fire. Ah. All right, and we will be building this one. Red top, gold bottom, red badge, black weight. I am Iron Man. Tell me this color combo doesn't slap. Like, yeah, the purple with the black slaps, but this also slaps. Alright, well, uh, they give us stabs, so we're gonna use them. Can we get a close-up of the badge? The red one? Yeah. Stab time. It's a shame that this is a 75. Those were my words exactly when they reached out to me. I'm like, I can't believe you've done this. All right, I need to see what the layout support even is for this.
All right, so... Uh, uh, no. 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 Why? Why? It's Normie Bottom Row. Because of course it is. Because it's fucking Hot Swap. Yeah, the solder version has actual layout support. This doesn't. So I have one, two, three, four steps. All right, I will use C3 wires. Bad choice, they could have offered both. Offered both what? Like both bottom rows? I don't think you can do both bottom rows and still, I don't know. Can you? Like, you'd have to get real sussy and st start alternating north-south. Alright, so four steps, right? Yeah. So that means eight of these. Didn't you throw away all the 6.25 C3 wires? Not all of them. Not all of them. Uh, I need a surface. This is a surface. Problem solved. Alright, we need eight of these. One, two. Why did you fall? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Cycle seven hot swap had both bottom rows? Did it? But with, with cycle seven, it was essentially like a TKL form factor, right? Because, like, the issue isn't on this side. The issue is on this side. Once you go 7.7u, uh, 7 then what would you naturally get here? Because currently, like, would you only get a single 1.5? I need to, like, look at an actual PCB to figure this shit out. No, you yeah, you only get a single. You only get a single. All right, let me let's just look at this and like look at the footprint. Let's see if it would have been possible. All right, so plate is aligned with the PCB. So if I were to shift, yeah, I'd have to go, I'd have to go north south north south. This one is fucking risky. And then for this one, that's also really fucking tight. I don't know if you'd be able to do this one. And also, like, your your stabilizer would literally land in the middle of a switch. If you go 7U. Let's confirm. Yeah. So, you would be inside of a switch. So, I guess that answers it. It's like this. This is why they can't offer both. Like, literally just this one fucking bit. Well, the more you know. What stabs are included in the kit? Free ones. They're free. We use them. Uh, my lube applicator is missing. I think Ham has stolen it. All right, and give me my box of lube. Clip-in? They're not clip-ins, they're screw-ins. Unfortunately. Fucking hate screw-in stabs. I would have preferred clip-ins. But again, the normies... The normies... I blame the normies for everything. It's all the normies' fault. They're just like, no. With clip-in, if, if, if I grab my board literally by the stabilizers and start whipping it around, there's a chance it'll become unhooked. 
You can't possibly have that happen. For Sangan, the left stab would also shift right, pushing you even more into that normie switch position. Yeah, that's, uh, that's not fun. I can remember the last time you had issues with screw-ins. Yep, it was the cycle 7, because the cycle 8 did not come with stabs. Or it did, and I compl I've completely forgotten. I don't think it did. We got scammed. We got scammed out of our $1 pack of stabs. Actually, to be fair, these are probably like a $4 pack of stabs. Normies would have half plate mount stabs. Oof. See, that's not that's not normie. That's like that's just like consumer, spelled with a C and a U and a, another C and a K. Alright, that should be all the lube we need. And let me get actually decent stab wires. Yep. Some nice C3 wires up in this bitch. And you are a 7U, so we hold on to you. And you are 6.25. Can't believe I am literally touching a 6.25U stab in my hand. Look how far we've fallen, boys. There's literally no hope left. Does it feel good? No, it does not. It feels shameful. It feels real fucking shameful. Like when you like when you know for a fact you've done something real fucking like you're disappointed in yourself kind of situation. I mean, the bright side is it's hot swap, so we don't have to fucking solder, but the unbright side is that it's hot swap. It's okay. Lolo, I'm doing this for you. I am building hot swap just for you. You got used to cigarettes, you can get used to this. I mean, sure, a human being can get used to anything, even fucking torture, but does that mean you should do it? I don't know. Ooh. Oh, they, they do the weird clippy thing. Like where they have to come in and then out. So your stabs can't possibly pop out no matter how stupid you are. Oh, all right, let's do the rest. I feel like they've improved their stabs a little bit. Soldering a 75 is basically a waste of switches. You are so correct. Can can we can we just make this the can we make this person the president of the world? Of the keyboard world? Congratulations, you are the new king of keyboards. I'm even gonna use these, like a little fucking cuck. At least they give you a 7U wire if you're gonna like do a real build. And to be fair, the wires are pretty good. Like they feel good in the hand. I know that's literally zero indication of how good a wire is, but it feels good in the hand. Just like these nuts, got them. Good in the hand is worth a bird in the bush, isn't that the saying? Absolutely. Alright, let's use these little thingy things. Where's my thingy toucher? Where's my where's my pee-pee stroker device? Hello? I found it. Alright, let's try and not cock this up. That is a really fucking weird LED placement on the caps lock. Holy shit, look at that. Like, at that point, like, what is it gonna illuminate? Like, if your switch is over here... I mean, okay. 
Simon, do you make nut jokes with your friends as well? Are you implying that, like, I'm not friends with people that, like, watch my stream? It's kind of a... It's kind of a dick move. These are, like, really fucking well adhered. Bro, what the fuck? Can you... Hello? Are these things, like, fucking super glued? Bruh. Bruh. Bro. Okay, for, for the record, I'm using, like, fucking five kilos of force to, like... Oh my god, okay. No, we're not using these. We're not using these. Fuck this. Fuck this. Absolutely fucking not. No thank you. I, 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 I refuse to engage in your activities. I was gonna give it a chance, but... What? so much normie in one day. I mean, I'm pretty sure any normie that, like, tried to peel those would just be like, nah, fuck this. Okay, I need you to fucking get in the hole. Thank you. Jeez. Right, are you in the hole? You are in the hole. What is nice is these aren't going anywhere. So they don't have the fucking stupid issue that a bunch of screw in stabs have where like the second you flip it, all the stabs are just like, see ya. Oh, oh. I am going to, uh, apologies for the burp. I, I briefly looked over here and saw a beer and got reminded of burping. Dude, I'm so used to a normal water bottle where, like, you do this to drink. And for this one, like, if you do this, then the straw is just gonna suck air. It's really been messing with my head. Also, available for October. Camelback, Bok Juice. Consider. I mean, if you need a water bottle and you want to support the October giveaway fund. Oh! All right, let's do some screwing. No, they're all gonna be fucking Phillips head. Let me go get a Phillips head screwdriver. I fucking hate my life. <sighs> is Camelback good? Apparently it is, yes. Like all of the October merch was like very high quality stuffs. Like fucking Adidas hoodies and champion jackets, all the good shit. Only the finest of merches for the Thoctober. Uh, where do stabs go? One is there. Oh my god, no. At least these are ferrous. At least they used at least one fucking ferrous screw and it's in the stab. Um, hello? That is a really, really fucking tight fit. That screw is like a couple sizes too big for that hole. No washers? Nah, fuck the police. It's hot swap anyways, who gives a shit? If we're lucky, we somehow short out the PCB and then like, I don't have to use it. And we can just build it without doing hot swap. That'd be fucking great. Also, I apologize for the burp because there is one viewer whose wife left a comment on one of my YouTube VODs. I was just like, you better fucking stop it or my husband doesn't get to watch your content anymore. 
She didn't say those exact words, but... So I'm making an effort to, like, not burp directly into the microphone all the fucking time. I say this while I just open the beer, but, you know. Why did they want you to use hot swap? Apparently, he's doing something new, and I can't fucking remember what it is. He's like, you have to try it. And I was just like, okay, I'll try it. I mean, I can probably just, like, read through the DMs. Let me read through the DMs and drink some beer. Where the fuck's Lolo? Dude, I, f I fucking hate- oh, he's literally like the second one from the top. I'm literally like... Okay, there we go. Okay, it started with Simon. Do you find a difference in typing sound between hot swap and soldering, especially on a top mount board? I said with a good plate, no. With a bad plate, absolutely. Uh... I then said I hate hot swap. He says I know, me too. The difference is hard for me to accept hot swap. Here's my plan. I'll send you the 75 and I'll send you two boards and you can build them at the same time and compare the differences between soldering and hot swap. Oh yeah, I was supposed to do that. I guess we're building two boards. Not today, but I guess we're building two boards. Kale sockets? Uh, nope, they are J-Wick sockets. I will show you once I finish doing a little bit of screwing. Okay, so he was supposed to send me two boards the whole time. Simon, do you know that today is Gandhi Jayanti? Is this... Am I about to get a D's Nuts joke? Did you know that... Tomorrow is Rosh... Hashana? That you didn't. I saw it on my calendar. Well, on the bright side, I guess we get to build both of them. More content, woo. To be fair, though, like, the hot swap is barely a fucking build, anyways. It's like putting together Legos. Okay, so we gotta do like same, same, same. We gotta use the same stabs on the other build, which was the plan anyway. Obviously, I'm gonna go 7U because I'm not deranged. And we use a polycarbonate plate, just like this. Alright, let's, uh, let's get some extra lube in there. Simon, why don't you do the authentic Lego experience of building and put some glue in there? You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Okay, I'm just going to do a very light touch. And by very light, I mean like, you know what I mean. A light touch for me. AKA like, slather it everywhere according to everyone else. I fucking love knobs. Well, on the bright side, next time I go to Paul's house, I can fucking steal more lube. I mean, pay for. I mean, borrow. Indefinitely. Alright. Fernando, what's up? 
All right, I need to use switches that I have enough for 275's worth, which I don't think I fucking have. That's a problem. That is a problem. Hmm. Kind of reminded to all the lovely people here to save up for the Black Friday next month, but it's the October, it's the month of giving. All the subs, all the donations, all the Patreon stuff, uh, all the uh, all the merch profits, all go towards the October giveaway fund. All of it. Support the October. Alright, I need to see if I have enough of one switch. I don't think I fucking do. And yes, Black Friday is generally a scam these days. Once in a while, there's good deals though. Alright, well, this is gonna be a fucking problem. I don't have a single switch that... Like, I have enough of to do two similar builds. I mean, for now, I'll just put, like, a random switch in there, but I gotta swap the switches to something else at some point. What about the QBs? They give you 100 of each switch, so I wouldn't have enough for two builds. I need to like actually buy switches. This is gonna be a problem. Ah, uh, well, Ripperino. Yeah, exactly. It it's hot swap. Just take him out. No, the whole point is to like compare uh, like side to side. So I will need to like pick up some switches that. <sighs> I mean, Paul probably has a buttload of like cherries or something. Compare from memory. No, I don't want to do that. It's rude. Okay. Let me try and get a little bit of coverage. Because polycarbonate, very flexy. Hot swap, uh, very annoying. If only you had GetX. Yeah, unfortunately, I ended up like giving away almost all my GetX. And my Gat Pros. Honestly, like. Gat pros were so good. This is a really fucking tight play. God damn. All right, let's see if we can get switches in here. Yep. 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 I have like 300 if you want some. I mean, Paul is literally five minutes away. Like, I, I'm sure he's sitting on, like, a couple thousand of a random switch, and I can just, like, grab 200. Oh, we have ourselves a bend PP. No PP, no bend. Black bottom, milky top pros. I mean, I, I even like the, uh, uh, the full milky pros. They were good. If you see ball... Ask him to send me a green sofa, please. Just buy it. Get Ball to deliver some during stream. I mean, he's probably busy. 
gone are the days of Paul like just coming over out of nowhere. I think I think we broke him after so many years of just Wait, I literally fucking have a plate fork. Like I paid money for a plate fork. I have no fucking idea where it is. Right? I bought a plate fork, right? have a Geon plate support fork. Where the fuck is it? Where is it? You saw it? That's really helpful. Where is the issue? Where the fuck is it? I mean, it's fine. It's gonna take us too long to fucking find it. Zoom out, we can play Where's Waldo. It's not on my desk. It's like probably at the bottom of a box that's inside of another box that's somewhere else. See, this is a this is a fucking problem. This plate is so tight and it's polycarbonate. So like, I might actually have to go fucking find a plate fork. All right, one moment, please. Yeah, I cursory check reveals nothing, so it's probably like very deep, deep somewhere. There is no harm emote? I mean, there's harm 3D. There's harm emotes, it's on uh, whatever the chat thing is. Like, not standard, whatchamacallit. Fuck, how do I do this? Without a fucking plate fork. Do you have chopsticks? I think the chopsticks that we have are way too thick. Like, Kate has fancy chopsticks. Tweezers? Yeah, I mean, that's generally it. I just don't want to, like... <sighs> plate foam time? Don't say the forbidden combo of words, please. Can we get a new Hama mode, please? There is a channel on the Discord called Emote Suggest. So do be the change you want to see in the world. Make us a nice Hama mode. Uh, for Twitch, it needs to be perfectly square. Submit something that's like 1000 by 1000 pixels. I'm gonna end up breaking the PCB and it's gonna be like the happiest moment of my life. I'll just be like, oh no, how unfortunate. I can't use the hot swap. Sorry, Lolo. Motherfucker would just fucking like instantly DHL me another one in 12 hours and be like, haha, get fucked. Oh, that's that is an amazing Alex emote. That's so good. Uh, 
<sighs> All right, well, we're starting to have enough coverage to like hopefully get some switches in now. Thankfully, the plate doesn't have any dumb meme cuts, otherwise this would be impossible. Okay, that one's, uh... That one is not having a good time. There we go. Ah, oh, I love Hot Swap. It's just so good. Just so good. Like, if this wasn't Hot Swap, I could've just put all the switches into the plate, put the PCB on, then soldered. Plate forks exist. I actually own one. I can't find it. If, if you would like to go through my room and find the plate fork, I would be very, very happy. Plate fork, class C and rebuilding class 1800? No, we didn't use it. No shot. Like we recently like cleaned this room, so everything was reorganized and I have no fucking idea where it is. Like, it's probably, like, at the bottom of one of my massive bins of, like, random switches and shit. Oh, we need to get some support over here. That's what cleaning gives you. You're right. Moral of the story, don't ever clean. Oh, no, the forbidden reorganizing. Uh-huh. Yeah, Kate was real fucking happy. Okay, if I remember correctly, like, the plate fork was, like, on my amplifier for the longest amount of time. And now it's just not. So I have, n I have no fucking idea, dude. Like, I remember seeing it, like, in the last, like, month and a half. And, like, logically, it would be in here. But it's not. Yeah, it's not. I'm gonna clean my desk this weekend, wish me luck. Don't, don't do it. Don't do it. You're just gonna end up losing your plate fork. F's in the chat for all the plate forks about to be lost. I feel like I'm like breaking the sockets, which again would be the best case scenario for this build. All right, to be fair, if I just like push it in real hard, it'll clip. Like it's, it's really fucking hard, but it's working. On the bright side, none of the switches are going to be crooked. That's something. Like, Lolo made the plate so hilariously tight that I think it inherently fixes, like, hot swap issues. I hope Box is sturdy enough. I hope so, too. Your thumb will have an MX imprint at the end of the stream. I mean, at least it'll cover up the balls imprint. It's already there. Push fast, the plate won't see it coming and won't have time to react. True. Oh my god, you're right. Wait. You actually have, like, higher than room temperature IQ. Holy shit. It's working. You just have to be faster than the plate. I fucking love knobs. Hey, thank you, Sink. Or the gifted eggplant. And thank you guys for the subs, by the way. I, I It's not that I ignored them, it's I want to build this fucking keyboard. I will thank everybody that subbed. Beer fart, thank you. Uh, threes, hello. Uh, Ying Yang, thank you. And Fernando, I already thanked you. Oh. Oh. 
See, what I love most about TKD boards is they send me a second daughter board so I can just test this without having to, like, do shenanigans to the case. Like, everybody should just give you an extra one. Not going with dual push? What does that mean? I'm concerned. Two at a tot? Bro, no. Oh, two hands? I don't need two hands. Not that weak. Bench PP. Bro, I still can't get over the fact that, like, the LED is over here. And yet the switch is over there. That's the most hilarious fucking indicator placement I've ever seen. Alright, now that most everything is in there, they're going in nice and easy. Like, now that the plate has some rigidity to it from all the switches. Is the plate tight around the stabs? Mm. No, I wouldn't call it tight around the stabs. Uh, yeah, no. no. There's plenty of room for wiggles. Oh, that didn't sound good. All right, we do have to use the same keycaps on both builds, so we are going to use CRP. Before everybody loses their shit and is like, oh, Simon Beige. Oh, actually, we can just use GMK. I can put uh, GMK bread on it. Because I have multiple GMK sets. Needs more foam. Hi, Zam. What's up, dude? That sounded like a Ben pin. Don't worry about it. Oh, I still have the microphone on, like, ultra-sensitive mode so you can hear all my farts. Nice. More gluten in builds for 2025? Hey, hey, hey. It's gluten-free bread. Alright, that is all the switches in the thing. Trim the PCB? I will. Hey, pretty face, you ever do any long-term dust testing? I have a problem with most of non-box switches after some time. Keeping it. Keeping it. Keeping it has door. Door keep dust out. Yeah, like, dust is a problem. There's a reason why you should, like, cover your boards. Or keep them in, like, a, a closed place. All right, let's grab a daughter board. Beautiful. You can use shower caps. <laughs> That's pretty fucking smart. All right, uh, let's see. Oh, that's a weird fucking placement. Oh, this is gonna be real tight in the case, too. God damn. Or wait. Yeah, this is gonna be real tight in the case. Alright, well, hopefully that works. Yeah, that's like, god damn. Alright, well. Uh. All right, first things first. All right, nice. Let's go to our favorite website, usevia dot whatever. Are you a U? No, you are an O. Oh, this key doesn't even fucking work. Eh, backspace. Eh, we got it, lads. We got it. We're so good at science. Media player. 
All right. Well, those are all the those are all the ones with Ben fucking what you All right. So, yep. Four doesn't work. Oh, H works and works. And I doesn't work. All right. So four and I. Let me fix those. Yep, that is very bent. And four. Yeah, it looks like escape is also bent. Good catch. Good catch. What about alt gir? Oh, true. That should have also. Yep, also bent. All right, four bents. And let's replace them with non bents. Good on escape. We're good on four. We're good on I. And we're good with Altger. Poggies. All right, let's set up a layout so I can actually use it. You are left control, you are left win, you are unbound. Uh, momentary layer zero, that's fine. Uh, delete home. Okay, first of all, uh, layers uh, and zero one. Okay, and then page down, page up, that's fine. Give me delete here. Hello? Delete. Yep, and uh, huh, what do we put there? Uh, we'll we'll put uh, media play. Okay, print screen. Uh, I like to put print screen there on the eye. Scroll lock. Listen here, you little shit. Don't even joke about that. Eh. Please use Iron Man theme keycaps. I don't have Iron Man theme keycaps. The closest I have is GMK bread, which is what we're gonna use. All right, let's break off the mouse bites. Eh. Okay, don't make fun of me, my hands hurt. Greg? No, no Greg. We might use Greg on the other one when we do our second build. Oh, all right, we've done it. You are trash. I think P was changed to zero on Via, was it? I mean, we're gonna find out when we actually build this. Or like when we finish this. Come on. Uh, oh no, I touched the internal brass like a dumbass. All right, are you the correct size? Nope, you are too small. Are you the correct size? Yes. These are really loosely attached from the factory, which, I mean, I'd rather, mm, I don't know. I prefer loosely attached to like way over tightened, but still. Boom. You know, the one redeeming quality of this build is that at the very least it's top mount. We take what we can get. They should be finger tight. Yeah, they should be finger tight. Like that is an acceptable tightness. IMO. Damn it. Fucking hole, you. <clears throat> okay, and last one. Okay, let me make sure my top bottom alignment is good. Yeah, it looks like it's fine. Whee. 
I don't even have exclamation build in the title and people are still doing exclamation build. That's amazing. Like, you don't even need to set up the mousetrap. People will just walk into it for free. Alright, so how the fuck are you supposed to do this? Oh, probably the smart way. So like... This? Like, it's so fucking weird. Like, it's it's the cycle eight all over again, where, like, you gotta need to have a fucking, like, doctorate in, like, science. Okay, my guess is there's still a mouse bite. Yep, there's still a mouse bite. The tolerances on this are mega tight. Okay, pro, I'm gonna need you to break off, please. You are not breaking off, goddamn. Alright, plan B. <sighs> I really fucking wish I had needle nose instead of. Fucking flush cutters. Fuck it. We just continue flush cutting. What are they gonna do? Stop us? fighting with it to just like not have to do the JST again but fuck it it is what it is bro this is like falling apart like fucking styrofoam just break break thank you jeez There was still one mouse bite attached. Oh, there's also one over here. <sighs> this. And that prevents the case from closing. Ah. There. Jeez. Alright, well... There's a note for you guys. Make sure that the mouse bites, why are they there? Uh, because, I don't know, they're there on a lot of PCBs. Ribbon cables, dude. All right, we done? Yeah. All right. And before I commit, let's make sure that ugh, this thing actually works. It does indeed. Okay. All right, let's close it up. Uh, where is my big boy? What's the switches? Uh, I think JWK or fucking yeah, they're, they're the wait. They're marked T N. Oh, they're no, that's N L. So it's either the NLAN Geekark or the NLAN JWK. So I have no fucking idea. They're all unlabeled. I don't have many switches just sitting around, so I just used what I had. But we will be rebuilding this with normal switches, 
so we can do a apples to apples comparison of the uh, hot swap assembly versus the solder assembly. Can we make the music more chill, please? All right, I'll change it from happy to classical music there. Everyone's going to go to sleep. Do some country music? Fuck yeah. Oh. Everything is better than Eurodance? It... I disagree. I respectfully disagree. Name one thing worse? Okay, you got me. I didn't think you were gonna give me a follow-up. Alright, let's do it. Let's do ourselves a peel. Oh, tell me that's not appealing. Tell me that's not hot as fuck. Tell me that's not hot as fuck. Yes, I know, it's a 75. Still pretty hot. Ah. Uh, Alright, let's grab some GMK bread, slap it on this bitch. Dude, GMK bread has literally never left this keyboard. Is now leaving it for the first time. Oh. oh my god, hello? Banana bread? The best kind of bread. Hey, we were supposed to rebuild this ages ago. Get the... Let's not worry about it. That cringe is so sexy, though. It's an enjoyable board. And I think it's like the only FRL I still have. Wait. Oh no. I mean, I technically still have a Cycle 7. Even though I gave away my other unit. No, I sold it. I sold it. Why did you not sell this? Because nobody offered me anything for it. Anything that I still have doesn't mean that like I wanted to keep it. I put everything for sale. If I still have it, it means nobody fucking wanted it. Like for a even remotely reasonable price. Because this thing was like expensive-ish. Like it was like 400 or some shit. I gotta rebuild this eventually. I offer ten dollars. Sure. So these are definitely the key geeks and not the JWKs, I can tell because the caps are going on and not flying off immediately. Didn't someone overbid on every single item? Not every single item. There were some troll bids that weren't real. But they were trolls. Like, it really wasn't that hard to figure out who the real bids were. It was as easy as DMing the person being like, Hey, did you make these bids?
question is, do you remember where the rest of that set is? Yeah, I, I have a dedicated uh, like uh, tub for keycaps. And I have a dedicated tub for non-beige keycaps, so that makes things way easier to find. Okay. Did somebody see a spring fly out of here? Because I sure as fuck didn't. And we're missing a spring now. Logically, it would have gone this way. Oh, I found it. Stupid. All right, well, fuck it. I'll fix that eventually. Semi-automated spring swapping, coming soon. Yeah, that's what happens when like this switch has no support on the left and right. You can just like rip the entire top off. Do you like FRL Salmon? Yes, I love FRL. The reason why we had so much FRL was because I pushed for it so hard. And then I had regrets because I pushed for it way too fucking hard. What's my opinion on the Kryn PCB? For the lore pit? I don't have any thoughts. What is that keycap set? This is GMK Bread. A key set. From GMK. That is supposed to be the color of bread. Uh came out uh, a little bit yellower than expected. I still think it looks great. And that's not a cope. But I understand that it was supposed to look different. Okay, and I presume we can't use any of these, right? Yeah. I want my delete. No, that's the wrong delete. Okay. I want my sucky sucky. There it is. Looks like cake. So American bread. Yes. I mean, the designer was American, if I'm not mistaken, so it checks out. Either that camera is not flat or that O is not aligned. It's just inconsistencies and in keycaps. Ah, GMK so good. All right, and I will take the page down. Is that the correct row for page down? It is not. All right, let's go find the rest of this key set. All right, and what is the actual layout support here? So I put a 6.25 view, and then I presume it's like 1.25, 1.2. Yeah, it's gotta be some normie ass shit. Spacebar, as gross as it is. May, may God forgive me. Five view bottom row super. I mean function. That's pretty cool.
Ooh, there's a double zero. Nice bottom row. Yes, unfortunately, we have to build this hot swap, okay? It was, it was not my choice. All right, that is a top row delete. That is what we want. not have alts? I found an alt. Uh, I feel like I'm still short an alt. There it is. Alright, there's our tilde. Four. F8. And let's try and figure out this nav. So, all right, page up, page down. These should be the correct rows, right? It is. It is. Poggies. Any advice for lubing Nixies? Uh, lube them like you would any other cherries. So make sure to break them in a bit longer than you would otherwise. I like to do like five weeks on cherries. And uh, go with uh, something not hilariously viscous. Maybe like 204. I wouldn't go all the way to 205, personally. Because you've already got a milky top, so that's going to, like, deepen up the sound a little bit. Just the spring and stem? No. You do the rails. And on the side, yes, all springs should be looped. That's why you need a loop chart. Oh. Honestly? Fuck the fact that this is a 75, but... Dude. It's so good. It's so good. It's so fucking pretty. Like, it's such a good fucking design. Honestly looks like shit, but it's fine. Wow. Alright, moment of truth. You know? It doesn't sound bad for a 75. It honestly does not sound like a bad 75. How does this compare to the Cycle 8? I think this sounds a bit better than the Cycle 8. But it still sounds 75-ish. Is this the TKD 74 top mount? It sure is. It's not the 75, it's the 74. Ah. Oh. Alright, let's see what it sounds like. What's a 75 edge sound? 75s just sound dense. Wiggle on that backspace? Wait, what wiggle? What? Yep, the Lord delivered. The Lord has delivered the horns. Oh. That is the wrong thing.
I'm gonna go get a cake. See you guys in a sec. Good switches, oh. if you haven't noticed. Oh, uh, this is polycarbonate plate. I will be doing both the hot swap, which is this one, and a solder variant build, uh, both with polycarbonate plates. Impressive, very nice. Let's see, purple 75 keep. Wait, where do I, I put it away? It should be better with an alu plate. I don't want to do alu, it's top mount. Like with top mount, you want a little bit of flex in there. Like if you're going to alu top mount, you're going to, I don't know, you could do better. It's, I guess it's preference more than anything, but like I'll trade off and have like a little bit of a higher pitch sound just so I can get a little bit more flex out of it. I really fucking love the side design. That's just. It's special. Okay, stop focusing on the letters. Focus on the side. Back is ass, though? You think so? You say, like, this. Like, this? Or are you talking about the bottom? I think the bottom is pretty fucking good. Like, it's simple. There's not much. I mean, that badge is really fucking cool. The badge is bitching. Like, yeah, like, my biggest gripe with this is that it's a 75. All right, now that it's built, let's find out what it weighs. All right, I don't want to stain this, so we're going to weigh it upside down. Twenty four thirty one. Two point four kilos. God damn. Dude, TKD doesn't fuck around when they design the keyboard. They're just like, yep. Yeah. Just put all the materials in it. This slanted badge isn't doing it for you. I like it. I very much like it. Oh. Alright, well, now that we're this far into the stream and we finished our build, uh, may I remind you all. 
It is Thoktober. The month of Thok. Oh, but Simon, this is this is my first time ever uh, in your uh, stream, and uh, I'm only here because I love 75s. Boy, is this the perfect keyboard stream for you. Anyway, Thoktober is live. As always, uh, all of the income this month, so all your donations, all your subs, all your cheers, all your uh, whatever the fuck, your your Patreon subs, all of that goes to the Thoktober giveaway fund, which will be used to help with Thoktober giveaways. So if you're doing pretty well, you know, if you're You're doing all right you know you got you got some extra keycaps you don't really need you got some extra switches that you don't really need hit up one of the thought captains in your area hit them give them a hit them in the face with your dm all right and just be like yeah i want to give this away and they'll tell you what to do and you send it to the thought captain and after the october is all over we will pick people that i will send holy panda you can send holy panda like you can send whatever you want and, you know, if you don't have, like, keyboard stuff to give away, you can always just donate to the stream in any way that you want. And, and, it all goes to the Thoktober giveaway fund. Can we send whiskey? No. No. You have to send keyboard stuff. Uh, also, there is merch. The merch for this year is uh, very fucking spicy, okay? It's... Expensive merch, but all of it is like super high quality brand shit. So we've got the Thok Juice Camelback water bottle, which, uh, wait, where'd it go? Did I eat it? There it is. I'm still waiting for the rest of the samples, but I have this. Mm. Beautiful. UV printed. So, yeah. Oh. We've got the champion windbreaker that is embroidered with the majestic words of our Lord, Thok. We've got the classic, pricey, but classic Adidas hoodie with God Thok. And it comes with a ham and Adidas on the other side. From what I heard, this is like a mega comfy uh, sweater. I can't wait to get mine. Nice prices, you know it. And then the final is the classic October shirt. We've got a new, I mean, it is a new design for this year, but it's very simple. Holy Panda, Thok Kale, Long PP, Thoktober, PBT Wildcat Sound Test, Thok. Ah. And there's a... Uh, there's a, there's a thing. There's a thing. Don't worry about the thing. Can we get a ham mouse pad? I mean, not for October, maybe someday. You just want ham? I'll send you ham. Anyway, if you want to support the October giveaway fund, you can buy merch. There's a $5 markup on everything. That $5 goes to the October giveaway fund. All of it. So... You get something nice in return, and you get to help out somebody in Thoktober. Enjoy. Am I missing any Thoktober stuff? Who dares ping me? Why did he ban you? I never ban anyone. If you've ever been banned from my Discord, which already, like... Like, you have to do war crimes to get banned from the Black Simon Discord, but I don't do any banning. We have a moderation team. The moderation team moderates. I have very little say. Like, I might be consulted once in a while about a particular thing, but I'll just be like, do, do what you're supposed to do. Do it. Simon, a person can change a lot in one year. I don't believe you. I'm considering gifting an uh. OG poker for someone who wants the same start as me, but I'm not sure anyone wants it, or maybe my old Geekhack SP... Red alert. Is there like a wanted list for Thoktober? It's don't don't worry about like worry about what like you can give. 
worry about what you can give. The, the we will absolutely find somebody that wants slash needs what you're giving away. As long as what you're giving away what you're giving away is not just literal fucking garbage. And by that I mean just like I don't know like half a key set or like some fucking lube applicators. Don't send that shit, okay? Don't send that shit. But if you got like old caps or an old board you don't use anymore or you want to pay it forward, send it to somebody, let somebody get started. Yeah, fuck you. Don't don't worry about it. Let me worry about it. Ah. Uh. Mm, bread. All right, let's see if I can get the bread into the bread basket from here. Okay, if I lie and I say it went in, none of you are gonna fucking believe me. How about a normie bottom row 75? You monster. I mean, to be fair, like, I presume there is a market for, you know, people, I mean, people that would use hot swap and a 75. I'll give you a plate fork as well, Simon, don't worry. I, I don't receive any of the uh, giveaway stuff. It would be sent to your regional thought captain. Then after October, we do a full inventory. Uh, and then we uh, start picking out where to send what. But nothing comes to me. Ugh. We have nominated people for that. Uh, well, this, this keyboard confuses me sexually because I love how it looks, but it like I look at it and it's a 75. And I hate that it's a 75 and it's hot swap and it's normie bottom row. It's like, it's the fucking trifecta of illegal. Well, we did it. I'll show you guys the purple one, by the way. Is it fixed bottom row for the hot swap? Yes, it is. Uh, I will have to pick up uh, like 200 of one switch so we can do a comparison of hot swap sound versus solder the purple is so nice though like the purple is so nice that like I kind of regret like wanting that like the purple fucks look at it look at it It's really fucking nice. He's ignoring us. Let's try in a year. What do you mean? No, well, he's not allowed back in Discord. It's not up to me. It looks similar to Mode's Elderberry. That's the fucking color. Why couldn't I see it? It's Elderberry. I don't fucking know what Elderberry is. I know that your mother smells like it, but that's it. Literally 1985. Listen, if you get banned from a server, you I got banned from the love server. Knobs. What do you want me to do, dude? Like, I know logically you're like, just unban me. No, I'm not. I don't have that kind of power. It's the TKD 75. It sure is. And if you miss the entire build, this is what it looks like. Uh, this is a color combo that nobody can buy, by the way. We got this color combo by pulling parts out of this and putting it in this. It's the Iron Man colorway. Oh, all right. Well, <clears throat> let's put away our tools like good little boys. Okay, 
feel like oh yeah it's supposed to go like that there we go yay we did it we built a keyboard and now we're done building a keyboard and you guys can go away shoo go i don't know what do you guys like to do on on wednesdays chase flamingos Eat flamingos? Sniff flamingos? Solder should support 7U? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to build the solder one correctly with a correct layout. <laughs> I know that it's like, like it might sound slightly different, but I'm not going to fucking do a normie bottom row on a solder board. Ah. Uh. Holiday in Germany tomorrow. Fuck yeah. Are we doing any Topra for October? I sold my Real Force and my Pro 2. So, uh. No rubber adome. No rubber adome. Like, I still have the one that I use in the living room, but that's paired to the living room and it's wireless and I don't want to fucking use it here. Ah. Uh, do I prefer HHKB or RealForce? For sitting at a desk, RealForce. For uh, like a wireless keyboard you're gonna have like in a media center, HHKB. Or a, as a travel board, HHKB. Do I have a favorite switch? Yes. Uh, exclamation German fetish, one word. Stream from the living room? It's been a long time since we've done a living room stream. We should probably do a living room stream at some point. When was the last fucking living room stream? I forget why we were doing it in the living room. Huh. Yeah, I don't fucking remember. But we definitely streamed. And I'm not talking about the D&D stream. I'm talking about, like, I did a stream in the living room. Now living room is cleaner too, is it? I don't think it is. Simon, do you prefer symmetrical or 6U spacebar? You mean symmetrical or non-symmetrical 6U? Non-symmetrical is better if you have uh, uh, right side uh, spacebar dominance. There was a D&D stream? Yeah, there was a D&D stream. It was pretty lit. It was, it was my first time playing D&D and my first time DMing. And I streamed it. It was it was pretty lit. Who is the dungeon? I am the dungeon master. I mean, the D and D campaign we're playing now. Pori is the dungeon master because he actually knows how to DM. I had no fucking idea what I was doing. More D and D stream. I mean, for that we need D and D. We need Pori to fucking step up and DM. I promise I'll behave. I'm actually close. You say that like you're like edging yourself to to DM. Or are you like close by my house? <sighs> Explain yourself. Simon, you have to tell me the difference between 1984 and 1988's then. Generally, when I say I want 1984 stems, I want stems harvested from a used uh, Cherry G8006 or 04, which is going to have some heavy use on it. Now, you want that heavy use in the stem, but you don't necessarily want it in the uh, in the switch bottom. Also, uh, 1988 bottoms had PCB mount. 1984 bottoms were flat. They were plate mount only. They didn't have the little PPs. So it's really, really hard to do a build with those, I guess. So after being out of audio for almost 10 years, I bought a cheap little Class D integrated amp. Shit got good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dude, tech has gotten great. But but there are still the OGs. There are still the OGs that, like, bitch slap anything that exists nowadays. 
close to being ready to resume campaign. That'd be dope. I don't even remember my name. What was my name? I remember what I looked like. I don't remember my name. Any cheap, good modern housings to put VIN stems in? Mm. I don't know. I've been out of the loop for a while. I haven't done any vintage memeing in a long time. I'll do more vintage memeing when I'm in the US because it'll be easier. What's my favorite weighting of Topra? Uh, 45 for HHKB, 55 for Real Force. Simon D&D sounds awesome. Yeah, yeah, we have a good time. Ah, we do have a good time. Alrighty, let's see if there is somebody streaming because I'm fucking exhausted, dude. I did so much work today. Whew. Literally nobody is fucking streaming. Surprise Pikachu.jpg. We got ducks and we got chickens. And we got Foe, who's fucking slapping it. Wing Keyless with a 10U, Smasher Pass, I would personally pass. I, I like having alts. Alts are nice. Ducky says thanks for stream. Okay, so that means we're rating ducks. Got it. Got it. I got your message. All right, lads. Oh, thanks for joining the Sussy 75 stream. I'll see you guys on Saturday. Please, 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 for the love of God. If you're not in the Discord, get in the Discord. Read the Thoctober announcements, okay? It is Thoctober. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Let's fucking do something wild, okay? Let's make this the best Thoctober ever, all right? And on that note, Thoc. Ah. Uh.